What's good fam? It's your boy Matt and we're back with another video. What's about that? Oh, Today we're gonna go drifting again. I'm super happy. Um, I've been thinking that maybe I should just instead of going to like every event and like use two pair of tires that maybe you should save up some tires and go to one or two events but I happen to have a lot of tires left and a f couple of friends of mine that I don't see very often is gonna come to Drift Tech as well so I'm going all right so the car is pretty much in good shape as you can see it's uh, mint condition we bought the car for about five hundred dollars uh, we're selling resale value maybe four hundred dollars so I bought it for overpriced no <laughs> Anyways, what I'm gonna do to this car before we go to the track, and this is gonna be the first time I'm gonna be on the track on time. I made sure it is about two hours and 20 minutes before we're actually gonna leave. And what we're gonna do is within that time, is we're gonna put this broken M3 bumper on the car, and we're gonna put this one, which is the I don't know stiffer suspension stiffener, whatever you wanna call it. We're gonna put this one beneath the nuts here. So, how do we do this? Well, it's not like this car is going to be original stock, has to be proper everything. So with this one, usually when you do with the um, um, with the front bumper and stuff like that, you have a, uh, it's, it's over here. You have this plastic piece right here, which is on the inside of the wheelhouse, and you will attach your front bumper here, but we're not doing that. So what I'm basically only going to do is I'm only going to attach it in the front here and hope it sticks there. If it flies off, it's gonna look drift car. All right, so the bumper is now in front, in place here in the front. Kind of makeshift way to put it here. But the bumper is still going like this. And it's not very sturdy. So we need a way to make sure that the bumper is sitting here in a position high to allow us to use the washers here. And the way that we're gonna do it is drift car 100%. We're just gonna take the drill we're gonna drill a hole. Well, here we can use this tool actually. Maybe you make it a little bit bigger. And then drill a hole here and then attach it up here. Here to make the hole. And as always, use protection safety glasses, is very important. <laughs> Guys, it's strong, man. You just might as well just make this hole bigger. Yeah, now why it feels strong? And we would say, yeah, I had that for Lona. My Swedish subscribers will know what I mean. So, we basically just take this one, this stick by, hang that there, like a charm. This is amazing. And what we're going to do here is we're going to put that thing on top of here to stiffen it up. And this is the final result. Right, so I just made it here to the track and for the first time in history of this year I'm on time Hunter is here behind doing the uh, air this is my what cousin up? Mike or Mikael or Michael or Mike that's your name and we're getting the car ready Mini is gonna ride with me first a couple times um, we'll see that she, there she comes there she goes hey man what's up who are you <laughs> Are you Ante? So, this is another awesome cool guy which does car vlogging in Sweden, Sundsvall Umeå. So a city like three hours north of here. And he also does it in like English style like me. So we're kind of YouTube pals and really cool guy. And he has an awesome car. Alright, so I'm gonna get ready for the drifting, but I'm gonna see if I can maybe ride with him or something after... Um, in a bit. Are you gonna, are you gonna go in drifting? You're gonna go in that car with me. All right, so we're gonna get we're gonna get changed. 
and get ready so that when they say the drifter's gonna get ready, we will be ready. Alright, so I'm here with Didi. Hello, Didi. Take off your gloves, please.
so the event's pretty much over. Look here, let's let's film each other. Tell me a little bit about yourself, please. Uh, okay, uh, my name is Ante, and uh, I'm a founder of a page called Shan Motorsport, and uh, we go mostly in in around Umeå, Sweden, and um, in this one. Yeah, in this one, and in Asia, Thailand, Bangkok, uh, Philippines, and. Britain. Oh, you travel there? Yeah, that's in, awesome. Like, track in these kind of countries. So this guy does drifting. So if you think I'm 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 good, I'm sure I'm this guy's standby. I never say I'm good. Drifter. <laughs> I, I do drifting in, in other countries, and I have uh, three other cars except, except for this one. I have one uh, Impreza and two Nissan S13 oh. that are that are we're building right now. So uh, um, what's up with this car? Tell me a little bit about it. Uh, it's uh, Honda Integra DC5 Type R uh, JDM import. I did not import it myself, but I bought it uh, from another guy who imported it. Uh, basically, it's, it's uh, pretty stock right now. It's uh, around 220 brake horsepower in the engine, and um, what else? It's it's a high revving engine, K20A engine, so you can rev it to from factory <laughs> down to. 8600 rpm i think you see that 8000 my car is dead if it goes yeah. there see that uh, that's death right there <laughs> so it has like iv tech it's a different cam cam profile so uh very fun to drive you know? I, I need better suspension because now everything is stopping the suspension i can't, uh, I can't yeah. yeah like this yeah <sighs> i can't attack the corner because uh, i have too low uh, little camber so it means when I, if i go hard into the corner I, my back tail will, will slide out yeah so, I don't know if you saw it only there, I spin out. So. Ah, are you, are you done for tonight or? Yeah. Every, every, everything is okay with the car? Yeah. All right. All right, so I accidentally paused. He, what did he say? You said that? Uh, that track one? cars is a big advantage because uh, normally you can drive through track and go back in the same way. Ah. Drift cars, if you drive all the way, they. For me, for me, it has a yeah. range. I think for many people, they always have an issue with them. So. And also, if we modify them enough to be drifting, then if the police stop us, shame on us. Yeah. Um, but it's awesome. He has a YouTube channel as well, right? Yeah, some motorsport. Yeah, I'm just gonna link it all. Yeah. And uh, I just think it's so fun that I have someone else here, here that I can connect to in the northern part of Sweden. We do type of this. We do kind of the same thing, I think. Yeah. But you're you're currently just uh, mo mostly doing track cars, and I'm doing drift cars. Yeah. Because I cannot afford to have two drift cars in my garage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not yet. <laughs> so we're gonna see if the track car wants to drive. But if, but, in, but in the, if there's no tra track car, well, there's one there. Yeah. Then I'm gonna go drifting. And I think next time, this next turn, I think I wanna go the small one. Because yeah. then I should be able to go all the time. I, my car is performing like crazy. I. <laughs> So I should not feel bad about hitting his fault, he no. keeps hitting him himself. <laughs>
we were on our way home from the track. Car felt great. I did some fails. I was, I don't know, close to the wall. These are the things that happen. There are different factors. So the thing is, the mistakes that I did, they were made when I changed the tires. So I have one tire which is hot and which is full of air, and one which is not. And then I get uneven grip. So from now on, I'm gonna start changing both tires. And if one tire isn't that used, I'm gonna reuse it. I'm gonna let it cool down. That's what I think I'm gonna do. Um, I think I'm gonna just order and see if I can stock use uh, new tires. I think I found some cheap ones that I can use. 25 bucks or something like that um, but today felt great I mean I was able to do skids on the straight which is something I don't think a lot of less than 200 horsepower car has done so it's a lot of fun I was three drift car there one drift car broke there are four, 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 four drifters three cars broke mine is the only one that isn't broken all so far I think knock on wood um, but thank you for watching. I hope you are enjoying what you're seeing. I hope you enjoy my my journey and hope that I'm making progress and I'm making the content worthwhile for you. It's super fun to to, uh, to 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 make. Mimi's having a blast, right? Yes. She's having a blast. She's gone from being afraid she wants to hit me when I want to do skits, and now she wants to do nothing else. My my cousin Michael was there and I was able to ride with the other guy, um, which is also called Ante, which is Ante's name, but. Um, that I interviewed a little bit. So it, all in all, it's just a great day. Um, three more days like this. I mean, there's like five potential drift events left this summer. I think we're gonna drive three or so. We will see. But uh, I'm super happy that you all are watching. Hope you enjoy what you're seeing. If you want to watch more, like, click like, share, comment. I want more comments. Subscribe. And yes, share this video I hear people that see me this one guy that works there he wants to, to ride with me next time I go there because he wants to learn drifting and I say sure man if you want to be in the car and ride with me I'll let you ride with me and we'll have a lot of fun with that said I'll see you in the next video peace